Minions out there. Of course, it is me, Quita, aka Belasian Quita. Welcome back to my stream and welcome back also to Sin TV. Of course, Sin TV stands for Smart Intelligent News. Let's get this. We are going right back in to more Tree of Savior. I am so sorry that I'm not doing this in one sitting. That's just life, you know, stuff happens. Here's my look of the day here. Mm, sultry and sexy. Gotta keep it sexy for you guys, of course. And let's get back into this bonanza of pre-Black Friday deals and articles and talking all about it while I'm gaming to Tree of Savior. If you see me look over, I'm just checking chat because I care about you guys, you know. Don't you know? So there you go. <laughs> Give you that Midwestern flair, right? So last time I checked here, we have Lunache and she is doing her thing. Of course, level 31, guys. I never thought I would get to level 31. Now, I was supposed to work out before doing this, right? But then, today, I had a 7.30 in the morning meeting. So my body, like right now, I just feel completely shot down. Like, nutrients are deprived. I got myself here some flavored water. Good old nature's touch here. Oh, this is some good stuff, my friends. Let me tell you. Hey, what's going on, viewer? How you doing? Welcome to the stream. Let's rock and roll. Go for Munache. All right, there we go. Do your thing, girlfriend. <laughs> okay, this is horrible. Absolutely horrible. All right, so last time I was talking about Black Friday, I was talking about how with some people, there's just some ungratefulness. You know what I mean? Like, it's just annoying to me. It's just... You know, I love people who appreciate a good gift. You know what really blows my mind is when people don't even say thank you for a gift that they got from someone on Black Friday. Do you know how much, like, pardon me for it, but, like, how much hell and torture people go through on Black Friday? They're outside, freezing sometimes, cold and hot and cold and hot. And Look at all these people in this server. By gosh. I mean, this is a game, guys. Well, it is the weekend, so, you know, people don't have anything better to do than run around and play an avatar. That's just how it goes. All right, now I'm going to show you something really unique here before we continue. I got to buy some swag. Um, this is what's called the party system. So if you were wondering why I was in that area, I ended up picking a character, well, a party whose character was, like, level 56, and I'm, like, level 31. So let me even see... If there's anybody, oh, okay, we have one person here. Okay, so here you have the party name. You have, um, of course, what the description is, what their average party level is, and then that is the actual person. Now, if you want to join the party, you actually click it, you hit yes, and then what will actually happen is you transport exactly to that area. So that is very, very convenient. But as you can see here, some people don't have lives, child. As you can see, y'all, we got people here with like level 114. That is quite impressive. Now, if only their love lives would be that decent, right? No, da da da. All right, so I know it's really cheesy, but let's go get some like merch. I need to sell some crap because I swear. And I am sorry, guys, for the lag. I know it sounds cliche to apologize for crap, but I digress. Um, it's just that this is a very busy server. Like, it's supremely busy today. So, all right, let's check the map here and see. You can also check, too, to see who is who, which is kind of refreshing. All right, so we need to go here. So we're way, 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 way off. All right, so we need to go to, like, the outer skirts of... It's, like, Ka like Kalapedia... It sounds like a Dimatap medication. It's like you have, if you, if you feel for Clem, try Clalopedia. It'll make you feel real good. Like that's just, oh my gosh. I can't believe there are that many people in this server today. And as you know, I mean, this has been a, like it seems like a month almost that this uh, closed beta has been going on. And I feel so honored that they even allowed me to even check out this malarkey. Let me tell you, my friends, this is so sweet. All right, so let's see here. Okay, so we got the blacksmith. Okay, where's the general merchant? That's what I need. 
and a merchant with a blacksmith. Wow, I sound really deep like blacksmith. Yeah. All right, there we go. Uh, let's see. So we have an accessories. Merch. I think I could sell it with anybody, really. Honestly, I think I could. All right, let's take a look here. Equipment merchant. I am merchant. Blacksmith. Market manager. That's like the story of my life. Okay. So if you see in red, these are all the different masters here. And then these are different characters or NPCs, as they would call them. Okay, so the item merchant is Marinia. So where the heck am I? Okay, so she's right here. Okay, so technically... Blacksmith... Huh. Right, so... She should be right here, then. Alright, yeah, 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 yeah. Ah, okay, so when your weapons are broken, you just click repair here, and then it will repair your, your, your swag. So, man, it's gonna cost a lot, homies. Okay, so let's just... Alright, let's see here. Repair. Alright, good as new. And we gotta repair that. Good as new. Anything that you see in red, that's what you need to repair. So we will have to come back here when things get janky. That is the story of life, my friends. Life really sucks sometimes. Alright, and then when I get a break in, we're gonna be talking about Black Friday computer deals, guys. There is a lot of cool swag going on, no lie. Okay, so that's the East Salai Woods. I gotta get rid of some of this crap. Okay, let's see here. Well, my frame rate is pretty much... The oh, there's the item merchant. Okay, there we go. So she has some general stuff. Okay, so let's look at miscellaneous items. So these are all the stuff you'll need, like MP, HP, Antidote, uh, Megaphone, you know, that type of stuff. Um, and Anvil is really good for repairing stuff. So I will confirm that. Let me see. Come on. All right, I'm purchased. All right, so what you do is you right click. It puts it into your queue here. And um, you just want to hit confirm. And then you have purchased it. So what the Anvil allows for you to do here. Let's take a look. All right, so that's the revelation. Ah, here we go. All right, so it says place item on Anvil and hit it to upgrade the quality of it. So that's pretty much how you upgrade your weapons is using an Anvil. So I'll be probably coming back here a couple more times. Now, since I've been running out of, uh, honestly, a, more MP than HP, I am honestly going to get two of these mofos. No, actually, I take it back. I will get like a crap ton. How about like seven just in case of a boss and crap? Um, now, I'll get some HP potion too because it's supposed to be dying up in these streets. All right, there we go. Confirm. All right, so you can see here you have your hotkeys and everything like I explained um, during the one, one of the more basic to, kind of um, guides uh, that I did to kind of look at the interface of the screen so we're good to go there so i gotta sell some more like swag to her all right so yeah we don't care what you have to say all right so let's like get rid of some of this crap all right, let's see here all right so i'm just selling some of this stuff because i'm just like sick of it all right and then you double click to sell all which is good to know so I'm just getting some of my money back because I had a lot of these items that I do not need at all because then that'll help to open up my um, my inventory all right confirm all right, so we sold some of this. Let's see, let's get some of that. All right. Oh, okay, so you can see here, that's your iCoin there, and then you have your actual funds. 
Um, let me see if I can get rid of anything else here. Okay, so you can craft tools with that, craft tools. Alright, let's see here. Okay. Confirm, and then that helps you to sell more stuff here. Let's see, I need that. Hmm. So I am slowly, but surely getting that money back. Oh yeah, these I gotta get rid of. Yep, that brought up my coin up a lot. Okay, so I sold, cause I'm trying to make sure my inventory is not too, too full, uh, which is good, you know, it's not good to do that. Okay, let's see here. It's like one defense, one defense. Uh, let's see, okay. Okay, I won't sell this one. Or, oh, what the heck, I'll sell them. I'll probably get some more stuff as we go along. Alright, let me put on these cotton boots. No, that's not what I want. Shut. Sure. Okay, you can remove them by right clicking. So, I want these out. So, there we go. Alright, let's put those on there that on there okay so let's confirm that okay so we're getting some more money and as you can see we are taking that weight off of us too uh okay so then we can add this so okay we're pretty much done getting rid of some stuff so that was good to show you guys how to do that and lighten the load for crying out loud um, let's see. I think I've repaired my weapons. I got everything. All right. We're stacked, racked, ready to rock and roll. Okay, so let... I can't even... Do you see how much chaos is going on here? There is so many people up in here that... I mean, the lag is atrocious. All right. So let's go pray to the statue here. And let's do it again. And when you do it again, it takes you to warp. So, where were we last? I think we were, let's see here. This is Stratish Gorge. All right, so we're not in this area yet. Okay, so let's look at our quest here. So we are, okay, so Neferous Cliff is where we want to be. So let's do that again. And let's go to Neferous Cliff. And then we warp there, and we're right back where we started. Right where we started, darling. Okay, so. Oh my gosh, absolutely crazy. Alright, so let's look at the map to see where we need to go next. Uh, let's see here. Alright, so we need to go talk to the Paladin Master. I like there's just people standing around. They're like, we got nothing better to do, so, you know. Alright, let's fight some enemies while we're going along the way and building my um, experience here. They have these hummingbirds. You gotta watch out for them, man. They've got some good evasion tactics here, so. There you go. That's what I'm talking about, keeping it classy. There we go. But what else has been going on with me? Not much, really. It's just, you know, I'm looking for work, taking care of business. Like, that's pretty much what I've been doing. Like, I have not... Life hasn't been really... Well, I mean, it's been okay. I mean, it's not, like, mega exciting. All right, let's see here. Okay, well, since this thing wants to be a dick, let's just keep going here. I hate these hummingbirds. They're just atrocious. Like, all right, so we got a hummingbird wing, and I also hate these banshees. Not even gonna lie, like they're really bad. All right, so apparently, there we go. Boom. All right, so we got that. 
Get that strength up. Yeah, I hate these type of enemies that... Oh, I totally got hacked. Do you see that? That really sucks. Let's see here. Alright, I don't have enough. Alright, so... This is what we're gonna do. We're gonna go into here and put this right here on W. No lie. Alright, so let's use that. Wow, it don't even help me that much, really. Alright, let's take a look here. Alright, so this is crafting material here. There we go. Alright, so we've done that. Alright, so, whoop, pardon me here. I just want to see where we're going, that's why, and then once I can put that up here. Alright. Let's keep rocking and rolling. And then we're just going uphill here. And just keep going. Let's see here. Jump. Jumping for me is hitting X actually to go from uh, platform to platform here, which is kind of insane. Alright, I'm going to try fighting some of these guys. There we go. Actually, this would be a great place to level up. Alright, let's see what these are. The brown, whatever. Alright, class level up, guys. Excellent. Now, if you see that green mater on the right-hand side, it's kind of hard to see. That's your class. The other one to the right is your character, which is what you're going to be using to level up, fools. All right, so let's do that. I'm going to try to see if I can get some uh, overkills here. Nope. I'm not going to mess with these banshees here, but, man, there are a lot of enemies here. Whew. And then the thing I'm also not liking is the aiming system can be way off. Way, way, way off. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Alright, let's see here. Okay, jeez. They're just... There we go. All right, well, I'm completely out. All right, now I'm going to have these things chase me to the end of time. All right, yeah, you can chase me all you want. That's okay. We could do this all day. And see, the thing is, they can only go so far, and then they stop chasing you, which is kind of nice. All right, so there we go. I just want to get out of an area with enemies because that's more potential for me. But we're going uphill. Isn't this cool? I feel like I'm driving a car. It's crazy. All right. So let's see here. Okay. So we got this bridge. So we need to cross there. And I think I got it from here. Okay. There we go. All right. I think I'm good over here. Okay. So let me get my MP back here. So, let's look over the best deals for laptops. This is coming from nerdwallet.com. So, here are the best Black Friday laptops and computers you will not believe for under $100. So, one of them is Dell. Dell is offering a 32 gigabyte um, drive um, for the Dell Aspiron Micro or micro desktop with Intel Celeron processor and Windows 10 for $99. This is regularly $169. So that is not bad at all. Walmart also has really interesting laptops on sale from HP, including a 15.56 or 15.6 inch, there we go, laptop for $199. And then a HP, once again, 15-inch touch laptop for $249. And then the 17-inch laptop for $299. That's not bad at all. But one thing you want to check, too, you want to check your peripherals when it comes to your laptop, guys. You know, just because it has an amazing video card, but if it has an i3 processor, 
you know, and I know there's things like overclocking and stuff like that, but still, you want to make sure that you, you know, and as a disclaimer too, make sure that, you know, check all these sales because they may change and I am, you know, I'm just saying how it is. So let's continue here. We got some other best or best Black Friday um, personal computer deals. So there is the Dell Inspiron small desktop, which is for it has Windows 8.1 and it's $199.99, regularly $389.99. And this is an online only deal, okay, beginning at 6, p 6 p.m. Eastern Time on Thanksgiving. So that is not bad at all. So Dell is really the top contender here, but there's also Apple. So for you Apple freaks out there too, um, for those of you who are seeking, and I'm just paraphrasing this from nerdwallet.com. So for those of you who are seeking a Mac type of device, there is the, let's see here. Let's take a look here and see. Okay, well, these deals are not that great, so I won't share those with you. Um, but it is interesting, though, um, to see this is coming from Forbes.com. Some of the um, interesting deals. So Apple is really, really going hard here. I mean, I'm seeing prices from as low as $399.99 for an iPad Air 2. I mean, this is pretty cool. You know, they have some pretty... Uh, some pretty interesting deals that are going on here. I'm quite, quite, quite impressed. But we're going to get into the opposite side about Black Friday and how some of the deals are not really deals either. Because I think it's important um, to look at both sides of this as well. Very, very important. All right. So let's keep rocking and rolling here. I did get a skill or a class point, pardon me. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to put that into my rag and wheel and make this level three. All right. So there we go. I was going the wrong way because I am a fool. All right. So let's keep going here. Pardon me. <laughs> I had to burp. I know that did not sound cute, but... Well, I muted the mic, so <laughs> gotta be a lady after all. All right, so let's talk to Mr. Paladin. Looking oh so fine. There we go. So, all right, so we're gonna focus on the divine spear, and then we have to use. Oh, okay. I think we have a boss fight coming. I think we have a bot. This is a boss fight coming. I have a feeling it is. All right, let's see what happens here. Okay, I think, yeah, this was the boss fight that I lost the last time. But we're going to see if there's going to be a difference this time around. Let's let's see. I'm going to go in. I'm going to try. All right, so you got to go after these little weavers first. That is the most important thing. Um, then you definitely want to come around here in the back and get it from the back. That is what you want to do here. So let's keep going. Let's get all these little weavers out of the way. Because they're the ones that are really the troublemakers for you. So let's rock and roll here. Alright, so... What you want to do is you just want to keep attacking. And I like to use me... Uh... Alright, so let's keep going here. So you want to just get rid of these little guys because they're the ones who are going to be causing you the most damage besides the main enemy here, to be honest with you. All right, so let's go. All right, let's see here. Ah, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I am totally failing here. Okay, let's see. All right, and then there are more weavers here. So these are little traps here for reduced attack. So then you just gotta keep running away here. Right, 
And then you just gotta keep attacking these guys. And poison is a biatch, let me tell ya. Alright, let's see here. Okay. So I'm just trying to get at yours truly here as fast as I can. Alright, let's see here. Wow, and they really have poison. Not even kidding you, like, this is no joke. Okay, so I don't have enough. I don't think I'm gonna make it, guys. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to level up, like I mentioned before, uh, to get through this boss. Yeah, that is a trap right there, guys. Gotta be careful here. Because this is not a good... I am keeping myself alive here. I do not know how I'm doing this right now. Oh, I was pressing the wrong button. I was like, I should have gotten a good half of this beast down by now. My gosh. Okay. So I'm going to try to run over here. But see, what's hard about this enemy are these little buggers here that just keep coming out. It's just like a bad, bad day. All right, so let's do here. Let's do some G up in here. All right, so we're at halfway point. We're doing pretty good as well, I think. All right. There we go. I'm just trying to get help myself here. I think I'm doing pretty good. All right, let's see here. Shoot. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, I am I think we may have this one, my friends. This is so stupid. I hate these stupid things. There we go. I'm just waiting for this stupid thing. Oh, I totally missed that one. Yes! And that's how you beat an enemy, guys, when you're a lower level than what you expect. And we got a whole bunch of swag. No lie, dude. All right. Okay. Oh, we've got the Demon Queen Jessie here. She looks really cool, though, not gonna lie. Whoa! That's epic. Wow. That's crazy. And 
and she disappeared. At least I'm getting my health back a little bit. That's kind of nice. All right, so let's, uh, yeah, I got some experience cards. Oh, shoot. That sucks. So we got to go to the, uh, the temple here. All right, that kind of sucks. But thus is life, right? Okay, so we got some experience cards. Let's use these up. All right, level 32. We are dipping and doing it, as Wendy Williams would say. All right, so now we have to go to the temple over here, which is in Flower Greeting Hill. So as we are going along here, oh, pardon me. Get my strength up, get stronger. All right. So she is going to go to the temple. That is not cool. All right, so here is Greeting Flower Hill. All right, let's see here. Now we have a shri like a shot at this now. All right, there we go. This is a green pure eye. All right, there we go. We have a large hook obtained, which that's pretty sweet though. Check it out. Oh, you gonna run away from me? Oh no. Nope, not playing with you. There we go. And then the indication for party is where you can see who is who is who. You know, who's in whose party. So it just helps with differentiation, so I can see why they did that, which is pretty sweet. There we go. Wow, people are just hacking and slashing for me. And see, I hate this, is when you run out of MP. It is so annoying. And you would think that there would be a faster regeneration process right all right you gonna run come on I like how they run too and they're like little punks oh my gosh it's been crazy too in the world of YT though not gonna lie so I gotta tell you guys what's been happening with that so what ended up happening for me is that like someone had commented and pretty much said like made the assumption that I did not like black men and I'm going to just clarify that because I feel like there is a double standard when it comes to the preferences that women have versus the preferences that men have so for example like a black man can like a white woman and people seem to be okay with it for few exceptions but for some reason when a woman does it people become angry and there's more hostility and it's acidic so that's what I'm gonna be talking about in tomorrow's video I'm gonna be candid and real um, like I always am just like how I'm checking out the beautiful views the beautiful views of this hill no <laughs> look at even the flower sway and stuff like that it is so sweet bro that is so sweet so yeah, and I'm trying to get my HP and MP up as high. I need to get my MP up. That's going to be my next thing to do is get my MP up. So, I got to make sure I do that. Okay, so let's say I have one more point here. So, that helps with that. That helps with HP. Increases magic attack. Okay, increases that. Okay, so let's put that into spirit go all right so that's bringing that up I don't blame her for setting and enjoying this weather it's quite brisk this time of the year okay so this is level 35 so I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go back to a previous area and just level up till I get to 35 I think that's I think honestly I think that would be the best thing to do so I am going to use my pendant and go back where I came from but up but no okay 
Let me get a drink here too. My throat has still been kind of raspy. It's quite annoying, really. Take a little drink here. It's good to keep yourself hydrated. Especially, I just started like my workout plan, guys. So it's crazy, you know. I've been working on getting into better shape and taking care of myself. So it's quite a trip. Okay, let's see here. I think I'm going to go to East Salai Woods. And then you can use this again until 20 minutes from now. Like, how crazy is that, guys? Seriously? But I, I'm really liking Tree of Savior, though. Tree of Savior is an amazing game. Like, I don't know why people do not give enough props to this game like it deserves. Alright, let's see what we got here. I think I could get some... Uh, I don't know why I can't get over the overkill. I'm doing something wrong. That's what I'm thinking. Alright, let's go up here. There we go. Oh, so I can't use this stupid tech. Get some money too. Oh, I have to make sure I get my, uh, that's kind of crazy. And see, I keep missing attacks too, which is kind of interesting. I should be able to hit this enemy with no problem. There we go. All right, got pets all over the place. My gosh, this is crazy. All right, let's see here. Yes! I just need to keep doing this, and when you keep doing this, you just end up um, getting more experience and stuff, so very important to do. <laughs> Excuse me. Whew. Yeah, but I think I'm preparing myself for Black Friday too. Is just by relaxing too. Like, I've already done my shopping ahead of time. I have like pretty much everything that I need except for a PS4. <laughs> Not like that's like under Laszlo's, you know, necessity of needs here. Um, but I've been wanting a PS4 for quite some time. It's pretty cool. Let's see here. Now I'm just kind of jerking around here. There we go. I can't use that. There we go. Got a couple more seconds here. There we go. Get my strength up here. Yep, I am in a very low level area, so that might explain why I'm not leveling the way I would like to. I like the music in this level though, not gonna lie. go to the eastern woods camp and see if that would be a better improvement there's a little skinny trail going upward here okay now I should be okay
So I know if I stay in this area, then what will happen um, is I'm not, I, like, as you can see, I'm barely leveling up because it's such a beginner area. So I want to go somewhere where there's a little bit more difficulty. There we go. Okay, let's try. Alright, so this is back to the city area, which is where I needed to go anyway, so. Okay, so I have an item with zero um, durability. Alright, so I'm going to try something. Let's try that anvil. Alright, so we have to pick the item that needs repair. Or to enhance. Alright, no, that's not what I want. I'm trying to see here. That's interesting. It's not working for me. Alright, let's take a look here. Oh, well, that was nice. Uh, <laughs> so I ended up uh, pretty much being uh, kicked out. I think maybe there was just too many people. So I think what I'm going to do, guys, is I'm going to actually switch it up a little bit. And uh, we'll play the mystery game. Not going to say the name of the game. But I'm going to get that set up, and then I will be... Right the back. Oh, no, all right, that's horrible. We're watching way too much anime. So I'll be right back, guys. We're going to play the mystery roulette game or retro roulette, as I like to call it. So we will be right